Okay, so I've just made this little little um, piece, which, is gonna, which I'm just going to weld into there like that, and I've drilled it uh, 10.5 so I can tap it M12, and then I'm going to just put a little piece on there and bolt it through. Then we're done. Changed out for a long ten, and uh, this is this is actually much better. I, it, I can feel it cutting nicer, and I, I'm not quite so terrified of it breaking. Thinking about it, what I should have actually done is go in with a shorter drill first, and then switch to the long drill when I ran out of length on the shorter drill. Pretty obvious that actually, when you think about it. So I've finished the next uh, through hole. So that's taken quite a while to do, drilling all the holes and uh, dialing everything in to, to do the threads, but it's all done. I didn't go to the effort of uh, skimming the side like I did on the other one because it was just completely not worth it. So um, next job is to cut the hole and weld this in, same procedure as last time. Uh, I've just been modifying the compressor upstairs because it's just not quite right, so I couldn't do it today because I don't have any air. So next thing is I'm starting to think about these putting these um, through hole penetrators in. That's going to be my next job after these battery battery pods so what I need to do is I need to know exactly where every single one is going to go and what I've done actually is this is my original general arrangement drawing which has now gone wrong because I've linked my parts differently but so I'm not I'm not working on this model anymore this is just my original one um, but you can see here the original one I showed the uh, penetrator going through the through the uh, tower reinforcement base there which is 25 mil so that'd be a bit of a pain to get through there so i was trying to think of something different now on my proper and uh, correctly done model here um, and uh, i've had a different idea with the pipe i thought i could do it like this with a valve on the side and an elbow similar to how i will do these ones uh, and that means i can put the through hull into it in a more sensible place now where it is there it's a little bit close to this ring for my liking but I can always extend that out with a longer elbow so what I need to do is get this uh, tube ordered so I can be 100% sure on the sizes and get these uh, webs um, sent off to the UK for, for laser cutting uh, there's a guy here that can do them but he's got he's so busy he's got a 12 week lead time on his machine so it's nearly impossible um, I've been through a few iterations of this trying to think of different 
uh, ways of doing it. I've tried pipes. I've tried a sort of a scaled down version of this. I've tried different patterns. But I always end up coming back to this, um, which is uh, how I originally decided it was going to be anyway. So I think I'm just going to stick with that. So next job, get these uh, these ballast tanks ordered.